I'm John Yinger. I'm a professor at the Maxwell School at Syracuse University in the Economics and Public Administration Departments, and I've been awarded the Steve Gold Award this year. I'm very honored to have won this award. I knew Steve Gold and admired him greatly. And uh, I also admire greatly the previous recipients, and I'm very honored to be in their company. Uh, I got started in uh, state and local public finance very early. I worked as a research assistant at the Brookings Institution after college. And my boss, Joe Peckman, asked me to write a report on the finances of the Washington, D.C. compared to city counties like New York City and San Francisco. I, I guess I got hooked. Then I went to uh, Princeton, and my professor was Wally Oates. And Wally Oates taught me three big ideas. He taught me about capitalization of taxes and services into house values. He taught me about the importance of considering the environment when you're estimating a cost function for public services. And he taught me how state aid and uh, household income are theoretically equivalent in influencing the demand for public services. Uh, the truth is I can't get those big ideas out of my head, and I'm still working on all three of them. Uh, uh, my first uh, teaching job uh, was in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and I found myself in the company of a large number of young scholars who were interested in state and local public finance. We set up a state and local lunch group, and we had so many good conversations and so many co-authored projects. Two of my co-authors from that period, Sonny Ladd and Andy Roshofsky, are previous recipients of this award. And two of my other co-authors, uh, Howard Bloom and Kathy Bradbury, are very well known to APAM. Uh, so uh, after I uh, left Cambridge, I went to the Maxwell School at Syracuse, where I find myself in the company of many fine faculty and PhD students. And I guess one way to summarize uh, uh, my experience there, uh, or to emphasize what happened, is that I have written papers with 15 of my PhD students uh, over the years. Uh, they include people who are uh, members of APAM, like Bob Bafilko, who's now my department chair, uh, and uh, Peng Zhu Zhang uh, is another one, and uh, uh, also um, uh, Feng Nguyen Huang at uh, University of Iowa. Um, so uh, it has been a very good place for me. As some of you know, uh, my most productive collaboration was with Bill Duncombe, who passed away in 2013. So he and I wrote 24 papers together, and uh, I just wish he were here to share the award with me. So thank you very much, uh, APAM, for giving me this award. And uh, state and local public finance is uh, still got a lot of good questions. If you haven't already, check it out.